Alabama A&M women's tennis team has been crowned HBCU national champions for the first time in program history. Today we talk with Sofia Rea on her experience throughout the event. So Sofia, I know you played many matches to win your tournament. How many matches did it take to get to the finals and win? It was around uh, five matches. Around five matches. Five yeah. matches over the entire tournament. That's an amazing accomplishment. How did you manage to stay focused throughout the entire event? I tried playing one point at a time and especially one match at a time because I didn't know how many matches it would take me to get to the final. Actually, when I was playing the final, I didn't even, at the beginning, I didn't even know I was playing the final. <laughs> and then Charlie told me it was the final, yeah. Speaking on that final match, that was over three hours long. What was going through your mind while you were playing that match? At the beginning, I was a little bit frustrated because I was doing the right thing, but I was missing the last shot. So then after that, I started focusing more on the positive things that I was doing. And I changed my mindset and try to figure out a new strategy so that I can win the, the match. And yeah, like um, take all the pressure out because at the beginning I was feeling more of like the pressure. Yeah. Your match secured the victory for the Alabama A&M women's tennis team. What was the team atmosphere like after getting this victory? After getting this victory, it was more like we need to keep working hard to win the SWAC championship and especially um, the positive energy from all the team uh, is like going forward in every practice, in every conditioning we do. So it's mostly positive energy uh, and yeah, just keep working hard to hopefully win the SWAC championship. Speaking on the SWAC championship, how do you plan to take this momentum into the regular season and get that SWAC championship? Uh, we plan on keep working on the mental health because I think that's the key on making a difference uh, with the other teams. Because uh, tennis-wise, we're, we're good, but the mental part is the thing that we need to keep working on. Alabama A&M Tennis continues in the spring season starting early January. Check out the Alabama A&M Athletics website for more information. Reporting for WJAB-TV, I'm Freddie Lawrence.